Now we're going to talk a little bit about line to line connections. We've gotten our double line uh, tied, so now we're going to figure out how to attach a leader to that. One of the best ways to do that with a double line is a knot called, ironically, the no name knot, or also the Mexican mate's knot. And then we're going to talk about single strand connections in uh, a very, very basic knot, the uni to uni. So let's start off with the uh, Mexican mate's knot or the no name knot. Now, this is one that you use, again, when we were talking about. Uh, when you're casting or jigging or any time you really need uh, to be able to get some line out without the knots getting hung up in the guides. So we've got our double line here. We're going to take a length of leader and it's a very very simple knot. You're going to go through one side of the double line. You're going to then wrap around six to ten times around the double line. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then you're going to come back through the end loop of the double line, but you're going to come out on the opposite side. That's very, very important because if you come out on the same side, this knot is actually going to cut itself. So you're going to go ahead and just pull on the tag end until that end folds over, kind of lube the knot up a little bit, and then tighten down. This is going to tighten down into a very, very compact knot, and the way that you can tell that you did it right was because the tag end is actually going to be perpendicular to the main part of the leader. You want to trim it, but not too close because, uh, as with braid and some other knots, if this does happen to slip just a little, it might not necessarily break, but you do need that little tag end there to, uh, to keep it in place for you. So not a very hard knot to do, but let's go ahead and take a look at the step-by-steps with some of the bigger line so you can kind of see how this works. So we've got our double line here represented by the orange accessory cord. There's our double line. And then we have our leader, which is represented by the purple accessory cord. You're going to come down through the loop. And because this is so much heavier, I'm only going to do this three wraps but you come around the double line three times and then come back through the loop. You're going to pull until this folds over and then just kind of work this knot down, seat it into place right like that. And then that tag end is going to be perpendicular. You're going to take that and cut it and trim it kind of close and that's basically the Mexican uh, mate's knot or the no-name knot.